is a saying uh, among historians that the past is a foreign country. It's one thing to talk about Stonehenge. It's another thing not only to see Stonehenge, but to understand that Stonehenge is just one aspect of a huge complex covering several square miles of burial mounds, rings, avenues, villages, uh, charnel houses. It is something you just cannot explain simply with a map and a PowerPoint in the classroom. They get an opportunity to see an England that quite often the English don't see. We are continuing a generation of people who see history not just as a fossil but as living and growing. Hi, my name is Lauren and I went on the England study abroad trip this past year. My favorite part about the trip was going to Edinburgh, Scotland. Um, we had a couple free days when we were there and we actually got to go to the Edinburgh Sevens rugby tournament and it was awesome. We were the pretty much the only Americans in the stadium but it was a day of great fun and really getting to know some of my peers at Stetson that I hadn't gotten to know previously. You were taking a class in a place where you actually got to see what you were learning about. So if we were learning about Stonehenge, we went there that day. Or if we were learning about Durham Cathedral, we went to the cathedral that day. It was an unbelievable experience and something that I wouldn't trade for the world. Expand your horizons by expanding the places of your learning. And I wish you a very powerful experience.